YouTube, we're coming at you from AJ Farms. We're inside the big red barn today. Yep, it was full of belongings, but they're now in the new farmhouse that we're building. But I got a surprise for you today. We're coming at you and we're going to be working on the Dodge. So bear with me. We'll be right back. Okay. Well, we spun the corner and now we're outside the big red barn, as you can see. And today, we were working on this here, uh, I don't know what you call them, but the arms come loose inside this vent from my windshield wipers, and I just fixed that. But that's not what we're working on today. Today, we are going to cut the exhaust off this here truck, this here 1990 Dodge one ton with the original 12 valve Cummins diesel and 12 volt system. As you see here, we are not telling stories. It is a 12 volt and mama is after me to get it painted so with that good stimulus money that the government give us we're going to paint this here Dodge truck make it look fine. So I'll be right back I'm going to crank it for you and let you hear what it sounds like now <laughs> without the Rush Limbaugh in the background and then we're going to uh, cut the pipe. We're going to show that process and then we were going to Hook it all back up and crank it and see what she sounds like Lord willing. She's gonna make it thunder, right? Y'all see all this good cedar? Some folks from church give it to me. It's over 50 boards And they're six foot long. They are not pickets. They are regular six foot cedar boards <laughs> Some of them are eight foot So bear with me. We'll be right back well, We're back so you hear how she sounds? I'm fixing to open her throat up. But I got to hurry because my preacher's coming. He wants to see the progress on the house. Look, y'all look up the Kearns Church of Christ in Kearns, Texas, and you'll hear him preach. He's a jam up preacher. And I want to tell you and brag on you about this. Have you ever heard of a preacher that would bring you groceries? I ain't. They're always the first one at the table to eat that fried chicken, right? But not this preacher, he brings you the fried chicken. So anyhow, y'all go to Kearns Church of Christ, Kearns, Texas, and you can hear him preach. He's an outstanding preacher. He'll tell on himself. He ain't one of those preachers that will stand up there and make everybody else look bad. You know, the better than thou attitude, he is not that kind of preacher. Anyways, let me cut this pipe off where he gets here and see if we can't get it back put together and uh, see how she sounds. We'll be back. Okay, well we're back. We're gonna take this here loose with regular uh, box in wrenches. We're not gonna do the air wrenches. I just ain't got enough room. Like I said, I'm supposed to do this inside my barn as my first project, but it ain't gonna work out like that, so. We're going to do this. I'm almost done. Now, you good people out there on YouTube that's watching, don't be calling or texting me or putting in your comments. You should have put a bigger pipe. You need to let that thing breathe. I really don't care. You know, I'm doing this for like $30 versus $500. Bucks. I'm doing it myself with some pipe I got from uh, AutoZone. That's how we do it here on the farm. We do with more with less. So let's move on down to the next boat. <clears throat> you know this truck is 30 years old. And with that being said, these boats sure are easy to come off. Right here is where we're going to fast forward it so you don't have to hear me just make conversation with myself. I cannot wait though to hear how this mama sounds. Once I get this pipe put on here, I got to figure out how I'm going to hang it. You know, this truck has been, uh, let me stop for a minute. Look up here. Can you see that? I don't know what you call it. z barded You can see right here, see where it's been cut? Someone has put underliner 
on, uh, underneath here. His truck has been taken care of. I make a joke that it has outlived every owner that it's ever owned, and that's true. They've all died of natural causes, mostly from just getting old. This truck has got 100, it's got under 200,000 on it. Let's put it that way. Hmm. Ain't that pretty? I've got my new haircut. Mama cut my hair off yesterday. She said, oh, it makes the gray stand out in your beard so much more like highlights. You're so pretty, husband. I said, well, thank you, sweet mama. It always pays to keep your bride happy. I'm almost done. I probably should have cut this thing loose. You know what? I might be blessed. I might not have to take this one off back here. Might get to use it. So here we go. We're going to cut this mama. Remember, my preacher's coming. I got to hurry. All right, you good people. We're done. There you have it. And put four clamps on it. And we're probably going to have to go back and modify it here and there. Over time, we're going to, when it heat, heats up and cools off, we're going to try and retighten those bolts or those nuts, make sure we don't have any problems with it coming loose. And we'll probably come up with some hangers of some kind to support the pipe. But there you have it. So we have about $30 in this here straight pipe. Let's go see what it sounds like when we crank it. Hold on. Now, y'all know Mama don't know that I did this, right? Hope I ain't messed up. Let's see how she sounds. Gotta let them glow plugs warm up. Okay, here we go. Oh, don't that sound good? Let's see if we got a little coal burnt rolling. Mama is gonna get chills, watch. And y'all remember, I only got $30 in it. Two joints of pipe and a few, I don't know what you call them, U-bolts. I wish I could take that ring out of the turbo and make it go shh, but it can't. But anyhow, it's the first thing I've done to this truck other than just do repair work. Let's see if them girls can hear anything different when I crank it this evening. I'm not gonna tell them what I did. Let's just see if they can tell a difference. Anyways, y'all thank the good Lord for your blessings. He's blessing us each and every day. We just gotta take the time to look around. Even if it's for some cheap pipe to make a straight pipe, right? Anyways, we'll talk at you next time. Bye. Listen to her. You hear that turbo? That's Granny Low right there. It'd be better if I had someone sitting over there on the passenger seat. Y'all hear that?